TikTok. She says, trainer gets caught on camera being a pervert. And when I stand up for myself, he threatens to call the police and revoke my membership. Blech. Oh God. This clip was going viral. A lot of people were reacting to it. I said, let's hop on the bandwagon. So let's see if he really did it. Jim perverts, I've seen them before. It does happen, I feel bad. When I stand up for myself, he threatens to call the police and revoke my membership. Okay. Slow-mo, zoom in. Do you need something? Do you need something? Do you need something? Okay, I thought so. Keep it pushing. Did the guy in the back say, oh, damn? Oh, Lord. <sighs> I thought so. If you're getting rude, you can leave. Nobody was looking at you any type of way. Just because somebody glances at you briefly when taking your pump cover off doesn't give you the right to post a video on social media labeling them as a pervert. Facts. This has consequences. This can have a serious effect on somebody's livelihood, their reputation, their family. It's not something to take lightly. I had the privilege of having a conversation with this young man last night. He's a Whoa. good, kind-hearted young kid, and he told me more about what happened. First off, He's not a trainer. He wasn't training that man. He's an overnight gym attendant managing operations of the gym. This was at about one in the morning. And if somebody gets out of line or acts like this, he absolutely has the power to call the police or ask you to leave. So he was not wrong in doing so. Mm. Also, he never said, oh, damn. If you watch the video closely, <laughs> That's what I'm he saying. simply glances at you when his friend looks. You put the words, oh, damn, which he never said, and you slow it down to make it seem as if it's longer. It was a quick, brief look. I look at people in the gym. I do it all the time. That doesn't make me a pervert. I admire people. If you're in a shared space, people are gonna look at you. Now, I will say this. There are men out there that harass women. There are creeps. I've seen it firsthand. I've stood up against it every time. This is not that. You decided to post a video for likes and attention to put this man's reputation, his livelihood at risk. He's the father of two beautiful young girls mm. working overnight to support them. Mm. And you tried to take that away from him. Mm. You need to do better than that. Mind your own business. The Lord of mercy. Why you mean to say anything in his reaction video? And green eyes though. He getting the girls. <laughs> All right, sir. Sorry, bro. Pull Here's up. my lunch money. <laughs> he articulated that immaculately. One take. But what I find sinister about what she did is for likes, attention, for, oh, they were looking at my ass. Yeah. It's a different story if, let's say, she's working out, squatting, and the guy comes up behind her. Oh, you need to fucking help with that. What the fuck? <laughs> so then when two beautiful women walk by me or men and I see something before I go to the ocean. Do I need to get arrested now? Glancing is illegal. They walked in my peripheral. Yeah. If I'm doing my set and I look in the mirror real quick and there just happens to be a girl right there. Federal offense. Lock me up. Send them to the slammer. <laughs> Ready for this? I'm letting you know what the laws are now. Because if we're dealing with girls from now on, you need to be aware of what's legal and what's not. So let me tell you right now. Ready? Off to the fucking slammer right now. Already? Come with what me. What did I do? I didn't even do anything. You glanced at me. Bro, I, I literally just... You're behind me. Illegal. In that clip, it's blatantly obvious that it seems as though they're having a conversation with each other. The one guy goes, hmm? Do you need something? Oh my God. He was also, what, 15 feet away from her? Do you know how many girls go on Instagram actively to show off their butt? She's in there, and I'm sure she's gonna take a picture of it later to go post. So what if he glanced at the front of her? Is that a pervert move too? Well, yeah, you have the crop top on, you can't look. That's a new rule. You can't even... So we gotta lock up everybody at the pool right now. Yes. If you are looked at by someone else, they are a pervert. That's a crime. That's a crime. Send them to the slammer. Damn, and pervert? Bro, that is a big word to just label somebody. I mean, who cares? She doesn't have to deal with the potential repercussions of that. Now she does. Oh, <laughs> internet flame lighting her up like a Christmas tree. Do you think she was hoping everybody was gonna side with her on mm -hmm. that? Because there are, like he said, actual women and girls that get harassed at the gym. Worse than that. Do you need help? Let me help you with that squat. What that does is that invalidates people who actually are victims of people assaulting them. Yep. I haven't seen it, but I've seen creepy dudes. I've seen people actually get assaulted, stalked, etc. So that's like the boy who cried the boy wolf. Boy who cried wolf, that's what I was gonna say. The girls are saying, no, but the guy here did that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, he was a pervert.
word, I swear. Yeah, but you can't be doing this. The dude has two daughters. You, you think he worried about you, bro? Taking off your pup cover? Trust me, bro. Ain't mm -hmm. no one looking at you, girl. What are we doing I, here? If I'm listening biceps and I see a girl walk by and she takes a half glance while I'm listening to my Send her to the slammer. <laughs> slammer. If you want to avoid any problems, just what? don't even go outside. You remember this episode of SpongeBob where he was inside with Chip, Penny, and used napkin. <laughs> and SpongeBob was too scared to go outside? Bro, that's literally what it is. If you mm -hmm. look at someone the wrong way, and someone else disagrees with you, whatever, and you have two opposing opinions, boom, you're gone also, you're wiped out. Whole reputation ruined because you mm -hmm. looked. I'ma just stay in, I'ma just stay in. I'm not gonna participate in anything. Oh my God. Bro, it's only getting worse. <laughs> and this one here appears to be someone defending it. There are people that will defend it. No way. She's not entitled, just a woman that knows to stand up for herself. Are um, you there? No, I'm a female alone in the gym with 98% dudes. I felt threatened. <sighs> Oh, is that her? That must be her response. Oh, that's the girl. I thought men could be women and women could be men. <laughs> How did she know that that was the guy? Did she assume his pronouns? She just assumed his pronouns and his thing. I expect the entire LGBT to come at that. Did she assume everybody in the gym was a dude? She sure did. Isn't that a hate crime? She's a bigot <laughs> for saying that. Can you imagine? Like a dude <laughs> sitting down on a machine. Hey, stop. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they weren't holding eye contact either. That is entitlement. And I've had this type of shit happen to me before too. Not to this extent. Oh, there was there was a situation where we were filming a video. Mm -hmm. You remember this vividly. Oh yeah. There was a group of girls and we were asking, we were doing an interview video. I went up to the one girl in the group. I said, hey, we're um, interviewing girls, blah, blah, blah. I wanted to see if you were willing to participate. It'll take about a minute. Her friend to the side said, oh, I don't want to do that. I said, oh no, I wasn't asking you. <laughs> they all blew up and got angry at me. It's things like that where people assume that the world revolves around them. They're the victim. In that situation, I wasn't talking to you. Oh, I don't want to be in your video. I'm not even oh, asking you. It sucks because there's real life scenarios where this stuff happens in terrible ways. But now it's like a glance, a look. I'm a female alone in a gym with 98% dudes. I felt threatened. Do you know what being actually threatened <laughs> feels like? Like what an actual scary situation is? I do. I've been in some scary situations. I hate to break it to you. That wasn't one. We all saw the clip. I don't know. Wow. Yeah, it's on diet. I think it's on a clip. But we were there, technically. And you go into the gym with the intention of setting up the camera. You were looking to like make something out of nothing. This trainer looked at me. He was like, wait, what? And she'll face no. next to zero repercussions. She'll get some hate comments. She can just turn them off. Back to her grind workout the next day. Does she have any more TikToks on her page explaining that? I wonder. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Would you look at that? Well, her account is private. Oh, okay. Yeah, of course. What are we doing nowadays? What are we doing? I'm just tired. Like, can everyone just Worth. chill? Yeah. We live in the most entitled nation on the globe. Everyone demands that you call them beautiful. And if you don't think they're beautiful, then you're a bigot. But then if you look at them, even if they are beautiful, <laughs> then you're a pervert. pervert. So don't even look at them. So don't look at them. Well, don't compliment them. But how does she know that those were even men? So shouldn't everyone be coming at her for that? I thought that, that was supposed to be the thing. Or nah, I can't keep up. You got me beat to it. Uh, we saw the clip. There's no way you can justify that. She put, oh damn. Ma'am, you making up words. Did that look like his mouth said, oh damn? It looked like he was already talking to the guy. He looked over, went back to his conversation. The other guy said, oh, what are you looking at? Oh. She went on her thing, so excited. I'm about to go viral. Gotcha. This is one of those cases where I think the internet helped. They put her in her place real quickly. I saw some comments too. I don't know if it's worth popping up where like girls were going at her too. Really? Yeah. Like we said, you're now invalidating victims of actual crazy misconduct in the gym. I think this should go to the fellas. I have never approached a girl in a gym and I never will. I've heard girls Let say, come up to me at the gym. There's a cute guy at the gym. He didn't say anything to me. Bruh. With shit like this going down? Nah. Never mind, bro. We good, we good. It ain't worth it. I'm gonna read some of the comments on his thing. I wanted to speak to him first to see what happened. He's a good kid and a great father. She must've been having a bad day or a bad prior experience. Hopefully she got humbled after this. I saw that video and could see how she really wanted to start some drama. She wanted something to post on TikTok. She was looking for reactions. She said that he said, oh damn, but you can see he was talking to his homie even before looking. Just kept the conversation. He didn't say nothing. Everybody's ripping her apart. Well, what's yeah. also strange is, all right, so she slowed the video down. She edited it. Congrat, good work on your edits. <laughs> you saw how quick he looked. She had to put it in slow motion. You couldn't even tell. To make it seem as though he was looking at her for some amount of time. If she caught him looking, she was looking at him. Correct. Almost as if she was expecting. Look at me. Tears my ass. Come on, do a little look. She's staring at him the whole time. Yep, she's waiting. She sees him, turn his head. Do you need something? Can I help you? Were you looking at my ass? I was just working out. 